Hey guys, I thought I would share my Trader Joe's haul with you and share some of the menu plans that I have for this week. Uh, I think three of the meals that I have planned are from the Pioneer Woman, and so I'll link those below. Um, I do have some more chicken, so I only got one thing of chicken, but I'm planning on making homemade chicken strips, and that's from the Pioneer Woman, and they are a family favorite. And so I bought this chicken for something else that I'm making um, actually to go along with the kale. I think it's called just kale chicken, I don't know, something like that. I'll link it below. I honestly, I am not a huge kale fan, and so this is a stretch for me, and so we'll see how it turns out. But it looks really good, and it has a lot of other goodies in it, and so I love the Pioneer Woman. Um... All right, so I got this berry medley. I make our smoothies with that. I also got this plain Greek yogurt. It is the only Greek yogurt that I could eat by itself with a spoon. And not that it's just that good, but it's way better than any of the other plain Greek yogurts I've ever tried. It's really good. Um, so I add that to our smoothies along with the berries and you know, bananas or Trader Joe's actually has frozen figs and they're really sweet. They take the place of your banana um, to sweeten your smoothie if you, you know, usually use a banana to sweeten it. And then I bought this um, Parmesan cheese. I love to grate my own Parmesan cheese. I never really knew the difference, but once I started doing it, it's really tasty. And we actually had spaghetti and meatballs tonight, and I missed this. I had to just use it out of the can, and I really, I did miss it. So I bought another chunk of that. And then I bought limes and the green pepper, and what else? Maybe that's it. Um, I'm going to make some fajitas tomorrow, and again, the Pioneer Woman has a basically fajito nacho recipe, fajita nacho recipe, and so I'm going to try that. So that's what the limes and the green uh, pepper are for. And then I love this trio of bell peppers, and my, I just cut them up and my kids eat them, either with hummus or by themselves, because they just really like peppers, the colored peppers, and so do I. And then I just got one grapefruit because, I don't know. If I buy a bag, they always seem to go bad, so I just bought one, and then I bought some avocado to make, um, I just like to eat it with breakfast sometimes, and also to make guacamole for my fajita taco, or fajita nacho thing tomorrow night. I just, I love sour cream, I love guacamole, so I'm hoping to, I'm hoping they'll ripen in time, and then I got a red onion for the fajitas as well. Um, I bought some grape tomatoes. I am the only one in my family, unfortunately, who likes tomatoes, so we'll see. I hope they don't go bad. Um, and that also goes with the kale and chicken and the penne pasta back here as well. That's all going to be a meal. <clears throat> then I bought the chocolate chips and the whole wheat flour to make some zucchini bread. I have a bunch of zucchini shredded in my fridge and I was going to try zucchini blueberry bread and zucchini chocolate chip. Well, I wasn't going to try that. I know that's good, but I was going to give the zucchini blueberry bread a whirl. And then I love the Cheddar Rocket Crackers, if you've seen my previous um, Trader Joe's snack haul videos. I love those. I love the 12 grain crackers because they're just really tiny mini crackers. And then I bought tortilla chips to go with our fajita nachos tomorrow. And then my husband just loves to snack on those. And then, and if it says reduced guilt on the package, how can you go wrong? <laughs> and then the sea salt potato chips, we just have those with sandwiches during the week for lunch. And then, of course, I got their milk. And I love to have the black beans on hand just to add to taco salad or whatever. I tend to use, we eat a lot of Mexican, so I, I love having black beans on hand. And then I bought some marinara sauce just in case I wanted to use. I froze some meatballs after I made the spaghetti and meatballs tonight, so in case I want to um, use those for like meatball slider sandwiches or something. The marinara is really good. And then I bought this peanut butter. It's Trader Joe's Organic. And I've never tried this particular brand before. Um, so we'll see how it goes. I just bought a little thing. Usually I just buy the Skippy, uh, whatever it is, the organic, or it's just bigger and cheaper. So anyways, that is my Trader Joe's haul. And I think I got everything in there. So I hope you guys have a great day and I will see you later.